Hey guys, it's Heather from Calva Plan. I'm here today planning in my classic happy planner. Um, this is like my catch-all planner. Everything important goes in this planner. Um, today we are planning for the week of August 21st through the 26th. So let's pull these pages off of the discs. I can't believe that this is the last week of August in our planners. That is crazy. Okay, so I've kind of been doing a floral theme um, all this whole month in this planner. So today, I'm going to do a floral theme with some florals that I haven't used in this in this month yet. So I'm going to be using this sticker book. You can get this at um, Hobby Lobby or Mardell's. It has some of these florals um, and a few stickers. So I'm going to be using some of these. Then I'm also going to be using those same floral stickers that are in this sticker book. And then I'm also going to be using those same florals that are here on these sticky notes. And I'm going to turn some of these into stickers. So that's kind of where I'm going to start. We're going to start over here in the corner. But you can't guess what I'm going to do. Actually, you probably can because I'm pretty typical when it comes to florals or predictable. I'm going to put some floral stickers in the corner. Okay. Now you can't waste any stickers, so I'm going to take these and put them over in this corner. Okay. Now I wanna tie in like several different colors. So this is a pretty peach one. I'm gonna lay it here. Trim that. Take the spare one, put it over here. Let's add in some green. freaking out. Who knows what they're freaking out about. I'm going to put some yellow down here. I love these florals because it looks like it's just painted onto the page. Okay, I could probably keep going. I don't want to go. Let's put a few more. Some of these smaller ones, just have them bleed on top like that. Okay, that's probably plenty of florals in the corners. So I'm not. Okay. Then I'm going to take this one. It says you can do anything. And I'm going to put it here and cover up where it says notes. Gonna layer that box kind of off the page a little bit like that. A 
This is like a little cluster of florals. I'm gonna have them kind of peeking out a little bit like that. Then, we're gonna put another one of these over here on Friday. With some more florals poking out like that. Then I'm gonna take these little to-do sticky notes. I'm gonna use my Tombow adhesive runner to turn them into stickers that actually stay on the page. Make, and I like to put the same element like on both pages so that it, it looks, so like I have both florals over here, I have two boxes, I have both of these, I have both of these, so that it just looks more symmetrical. Okay, this is a cute little um, page banner, page flag looking thing. So I'm gonna put that there and I'm gonna layer it with this bright to-do sticker to tie in some fun colors. I really like this one. It says you got this, but it has those same florals. So I'm gonna put that to cover up that header. I really like this sticker, but I can't decide. I guess I'm just gonna have like a little cluster of stickers right there. Not exactly sure how I feel about it, but it's there now, so. I'm trying to decide, I'm looking at this sticker and I'm trying to decide if I wanna put it anywhere, but I don't think that I do. Also have this little floral sticker here, but just because it matches doesn't mean I have to use it. Sometimes I get into thinking like, it's so perfect, you need to use it. It's a really big icon sticker. Sometimes when the icon stickers are really big and I don't want them to take up that much room, I cut them in half and then I line them up right along the box and just use half of them. Like that. Let's use one of these blue ones to tie in that blue box up here. It would probably be helpful to use a similar color. This right here is like the, the cluster of stickers that never ends. I'm gonna just add some check boxes. Okay, I think I'm gonna put this sticker book away so that I quit using it. 
Now I'm looking at this page of sticky notes. I'm gonna use my tape runner again because these are, I mean, they're made to be sticky notes, but I want them to be stickers because it drives me crazy when things fall off of a page. Now I could have used my checklist thing to make those perfect, but I don't know where it is. <laughs> okay, I think I'm gonna put this away too. I kind of like how I have like a cluster of stickers here and a cluster of stickers here. And I don't really wanna mess with that vibe. So, I think that I might say this is, this is it. This is done and ready to go. And my pen can kind of add the rest of the decor. So, if you like this video, I hope you'll hit the like button. If you want to see more videos like this, hit that subscribe button and happy planning.